Hey guys. Well, guess what I'm doing today? Yep, another mukbang. And today, I got checkers. I love checkers. Um, I like their burgers better than Sonic. I really do. The beef on the beef patty tastes so good. So I'm gonna dig in. And I'm in the car today. It's it's actually uh, cool outside. That's why I thought I'd do my mukbang today because it's not hot at all. It's like 70 something degrees and kind of cloudy and rainy. And I'm just sitting here over at the, um, in the parking lot over here at the old Houston Mall parking lot. The Now it's the Health Pavilion. So I'm sitting over here. So today, what I... <coughs> What I usually get when I go to Checkers, I get a Checker Burger combo. I usually get a small, but today I got a medium size so I could get a medium drink. But, um, and usually, usually with the small, the small, um, it's a pretty decent size, um, drink and fry and burger, so. But I usually get a hot dog. Because I'm usually still hungry. So so I'm going to dig in to this hot dog. I got a hot dog. Just the basic ketchup and mustard hot dog here. I'm trying to not get it. I'm wearing a new shirt. So I'm trying to be careful. <coughs> so how's everybody doing today? Um, Today is... What is today? Monday. I did not go take a nap yesterday. Well, it was either take a nap or go swimming and it was cloudy yesterday so I did not swim so I decided to take a nap yesterday. But I didn't even fall asleep. I just lay there. But here's my hot dog. It's just a hot dog with ketchup and mustard. And I used to eat checkers back in the 90s, back in the day. Um, before church, I'll come over here before church when we had church over here at the old church building on Alberta. Like this side of town where Checkers is, this was like the the happening spot of Warner Robins. This area, you know, we have the Houston Mall, um, but there's really nothing over on this side of town um, anymore. Really, it's everything's out in Centerville now. So I don't really come on this side of town. Um, when when I do come on this side of town just to eat at Checkers, it reminds, like, I, I think back to like the early 90s. It brings back memories of, you know, going to church over there on Alberta, over there at First Assembly over there on Alberta in the old building. And back when I was in high school and, you know, but I, Checkers is on the other side of town for me, so I don't come over here that often. Um, but I, I just started coming back over here because my eating places that I used to eat at are gone. So I have to find new places to eat. So anyway, I'm going to eat my hot dog. Mmm. I love just a basic hot dog. Um, I have not tried the Checkers app. I put it on my phone, but then I took it off because I didn't know if it would really be worth me even having it because I only come over here like once a week now. Mmm. And, mmm. I'm hungry today. And also, guys... The french fries are so lit. The seasoned fries. Mm. These fries are so lit. Mm. Like I said, I'm, I'm starving today. So, yeah, so, um, and this is a, this is a medium. Look how big that is. Uh, 
Um, so I went and saw that movie last week. Mm. Free Guy with Ryan Reynolds. And I didn't know what in the heck was going on. I guess you got to be in the video games and like a nerd to know what was going on. I did not know what was going on. And I'll thank God, thank God we were in the LX because I was falling asleep. So I was in the nice reclining chair. Hmm. Um. But Eric loved it. So. We, uh, oh. After the movie, I didn't know what I wanted to eat. So, we ended up eat. We were going to go eat at, like, Olive Garden or Outback. But it was 7 o'clock when we got out of the movie. So, you know, and Warner Robins on a Friday or a Saturday evening. You can forget about Outback and Olive Garden. You can just forget it. So, I didn't know where else to go, and Eric didn't want Mexican, so I said, well, what about that curry mantra place? The Indian food? We got right in over there. And he's been there a few times, but I've only, that was my second time, and, I, and it had it'd been a while, like a long time. And, mm, I really didn't want that, but I'm just tired of eating. I'm running out of places to eat around here. I'm just tired of eating. Because since he's been working at home, our eating schedules are not on the same page. Because most of the time when I eat, I eat so I'm not hungry. And then he'll be hungry, and then I'm not even hungry in the evening. But, we went to the Curry Mantra place. And, I don't, you know, I'm, I'm not an Indian food person, so I don't know. The last time I ate there, I had chicken tikka marsala. That's pretty good. So this time I got something. It was like, it was the rice and it was grilled chicken. It was grilled chicken. It was marinated and it had onion. And uh, it was pretty good. It didn't really taste like anything special, like Indian-ish. Like it was just grilled chicken and rice and like onion. But I tried a little bit of... Um, what I just dipped one of my pieces of bread in Eric's what he got. I'm glad I didn't get that what he got because it was spicy. That Indian food, if you don't know what it is, you could end up getting something spicy. Because his was pretty hot. We got some bread. Some flat bread called nam n-a-m nam it's like a flat bread and it's got garlic on it it's like a garlic bread and it came with two dipping sauces a green one and like a sweet one it was like a red flavored like a red it was good but um I wouldn't eat there a lot. But I, I really like the Thai place in town that we go to called Thai Pepper. And then I like Metropolis Grill. Um, there's some Vietnamese place around here that Eric said was good. I'm, I'm going to have to try it just to see. Um... Mm. So, 
that Free Guy movie with Ryan Reynolds. I just, I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. I just don't know if I liked it or not. I mean, it was funny, you know. It was a light-hearted movie. Better than that crap I saw last week. The Green Knight. Oh my gosh, that was so stupid. It was so weird. Okay, I'm going to crack into this Checker Burger. Now, the Checker Burgers, the thing about them is they're small. They're really small. That's why I get a hot dog. Okay, so they have the Champ Burger, the Champ Burger and the Checker Burger. The Checker Burger is what I got. It has everything on it. Lettuce, mayonnaise, everything. The thing about those, both of those, they're single patty burgers, but they're really small. They're the same size. The only difference between the Champ Burger and the Checker Burger is the bun. This has sesame seeds, and the Champ Burger is like a buttery toasted bun with no sesame seeds. And you can get cheese on either the Champ or this. So, they're really small burgers, so I get a hot dog to go with it. Because they're other, all the other burgers on the menu. The Big Buford, um, the, all the other types of burgers they got. They are double patties. Or, they got one burger that's a triple patty. And I'm like, I don't want a double patty burger. I just want to... Um, I just wanted a bacon cheeseburger one day, but they didn't have just bacon cheeseburger single patty. They got, they have a burger, it's got cheese, bacon, I forgot what it's called, but it's double patty. So I got it, and it was too much. I couldn't even eat the whole thing. I just want a single patty burger. Mmm. Man. This is good right here. You can forget Sonic. Mmm. 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 Um. So, I've been going to the library. the Centerville Library and um mm. it's been nicer because the kids went back to school but I cannot stand when people talk on their phone in the library it's so rude. Man. Well. I went to the doctor today. And I thought, oh, I'm going to have to wait in the car. For like two hours. They, I actually got in and out quick today. Um, I was only in there 8.30. To 9.30. So, today was a good day as far as waiting time. It's crazy. Having to wait in your cars. But, you know, that's the only place I wear a mask. Because I definitely will wear one in the doctor. Because everybody's sick. But as far as anywhere. And the doctor, he's trying to scare the crap out of me today. And I'm just not even buying it. Not even buying it. Um. 
So that's what I did this morning. So next week, next week, the 26th, guess what time it is? Harry Connick Jr. Oh, <gasps> Ooh, I can't wait. Mm. I cannot wait. Man, y'all just don't even know how excited I am. I'm so excited. I'm about to drive Eric nuts because I've been talking about Harry Connick Jr. Well, we're just going to go and tailgate out in the parking lot. Mm. I cannot wait. My first concert in over a year. And it's Harry Connick Jr. Oh, I can't wait. I'm so excited, you guys. Because I straight up told Eric, it's been a crap year. I need to do something fun. And I just can't wait. I'm just praying. Because it's outside. I'm just praying to God that it doesn't rain. I'm taking a rain poncho just in case. But I pray to God it don't rain. I need this concert. I need it. I cannot wait. Oh, God, I can't wait. And I saw a set list. And, um, uh, <laughs> um, you would think, okay, so when Harry does a concert, he, you would think that he would do, you know, the CD that he has out at the time, but he doesn't. Sometimes he don't even do any of the songs off the new CD that he has out at the time. He might just do one song, because, like, the last time I saw him, gosh, it was like four or five summers ago, and he had a CD out, a new CD, and he only did, like, one song from it and that was it and the rest was a variety he doesn't do the same stuff set lists like every time you see him it's a different um concert it's a different thing that's what i like about harry he does different things these fries are off the chain <laughs> Um, so that's the good, that's one thing about Harry that you'd be surprised about if you've never seen him before. Whew. So, the concert <coughs> is at Chastain Park. I don't really like Chastain Park because... You can eat. They got tables and people bring, you know, picnics and all this crap. And they don't pay attention. They just talk. And it's really annoying. Last time I saw Harry, these girls behind us kept talking. And then they get up. During the concert, I don't know where they went. They might have went to the bathroom. They were gone. They were gone for like 20 minutes during the concert. And I'm like, you're going to pay all this money for this concert. And you're not even at your seat watching it. Look, when I go to concert at Chastain Park, I stay at my seat. If I'm going to spend a bunch of money, I'm not going to get up for like 30 minutes and leave my seat. I'm going to stay and watch the show. Especially if it's Harry. I don't know. So, that's 
so I don't know if y'all notice I've I, I've been coughing in my videos well I can't get rid of this stupid cough the doctor keeps prescribing me stuff it'll work for like a five seconds and then it comes back so today I was like look the stinking cough ain't going away so he gave me a prescription for something else something I already have been on before we'll see it's annoying it's always something when you're when you're my age when you get to be the age I am it's always something your feet hurt something's going on you coughing something hurts it's always something you get gray hair well I'm fixing to get this taken care of I really like my my short hair I like the style of my hair the cut is the, I think it's the best cut I've gotten so far but the color I need to definitely get it taken care of it's just a, a pain in the butt trying to maintain your hair color that's why I haven't done it because it's too messy if I do it myself and then if I go get it done, it's going to cost a crap ton of money. Um, I got some package hauls coming up. And um, if y'all want to look at my Mercari, just let me know. I'll send you the link because you can't look me up by username. That is the most ridiculous thing. But... This week, as far as movies, I want to go see Don't Breathe 2, and I want to go see Respect, about Aretha Franklin. There's another movie, it's not being broad broadcast, you know, on TV or any commercials. Um, the movie theater, they play these, like, independent movies, I guess you would call them. That they don't, they're not advertising on the, you know, on TV or anything like that. Or even showing trailers for them. Um, it's called Charming Hearts. It sounded like a cute movie. Like a romance movie. So tomorrow, for $5 Tuesday, I'm going to try that Charming Hearts movie. Now, the Galleria is back at its normal hours now because summer's over, pretty much. So, I have to wait for the Galleria movie to open, like, at, like, 4. So, I have to wait all day. So, it looks like Houston Lakes, they're, they're still at their normal times. They're open seven days a week around lunchtime. So I'm going to go to how start going to Houston Lakes. Um and then I haven't been swimming cuz of the weather. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. But I'm definitely excited about Harry. I just oh man. I just can't stop thinking about it. That's next Thursday. I'm counting down the days. Um, the other day, I was watching that movie, Mamma Mia. I like that movie. Actually, it was the sequel, Mamma Mia. The sequel's called Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again. Both of those movies are really good. If you want a, like a clean movie, go watch Mamma Mia and Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again. Because both of them are really good. I didn't really listen to ABBA's music before. Um, 
just like with the the Bohemian Rhapsody movie. I didn't really listen to Queen before. But after seeing those movies, I'm like, oh, there's some pretty good songs. Well, so, this is good right here. Just a good old Coke. And I, I know I shouldn't be drinking it. I should be drinking water, but I forgot water. I keep forgetting my water. I usually bring the water with me, but I forgot. So, um, anyway, I got some more things coming. I got things coming in the mail, and I hate when it says something's coming, and I check the tracking, and the tracking doesn't give me the information. I'm waiting for something I ordered from newkidsontheblock.com and I haven't gotten a, a tracking number yet. Oh, and if anybody does like New Kids on the Block, they got a free app now. A, a, it's pretty nice. I mean, it's free. So, yeah, heck yeah. I put that app on my phone and my tablet. It's a really nice app for free. And I ordered something from it. And I hope it comes soon because I really want to share what I got with y'all. So, I need to get off of here and I will talk.